Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I got a new project for you guys, and uh, let's just show you guys what it is. Smoking with the Migos, it's just me and me and Migos. Uh. Guys, so I just got done buying a car. You guys look at the key. That is the car. Um, I want to do a project for you guys. And what else? You know, the car doesn't even run. So, yeah. I'm, 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 this is going to be a new project. Right now, I'm going to call my mom, see what's up, see how she reacts to me just buying a whole other car. I'm good. Cody? <laughs> All right. Um, so, uh, I'm close to Vallejo. No. <laughs> I'm like, uh, what What do you think I just did? <laughs> what do you think I did? I don't know what you did. Why do you think I'm an hour away from the house? I don't know, I just felt it. What do you felt it? <laughs> okay, well, um, I, we, 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 we went out and there was a good deal on a BMW, so we went ahead and just bought it. Yeah, flat out. Don't worry about that. <laughs> I saw weed on the side. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, Bob, the car was so cheap that I could I could probably like um I could sell the rims and pay for itself. Yeah, I, I have it in the trunk. It just broke off. I bought another car and I went down this road and I can show you the mount for it just broke as I went in to buy the car. Okay. And that tow truck that was right there behind me, that was the car I just bought. Where are you guys from? I'm from Elk Grove. So I mean, like when I pulled up, I'll show you my the plate. Can I show it to you? No, it's all right. Yeah, it just, it literally just snapped the bracket. So I, I was like, I don't want to, I don't want to lose my plate. So I just threw it in the trunk. What were you guys doing up here? I just bought a car. That tow truck behind me, uh -huh. that's a car I just bought. It's a total car, but I'm, it's a project of mine I want to work on. We got a call about 30 minutes ago. You guys were out somewhere off of in Shingle Spring. Yeah, <laughs> I figured. Out. I was literally parking in front of the house, and this lady, I don't know where, comes up, pulls behind me in the truck, takes a picture, and says, this guy was like disturbing the piece or whatever. Gotcha. And I was like, I, I didn't we, even say yeah. anything. I just stayed inside the car, and I told the guy that I'm buying the car from, if the cops show up, don't tell him I left or anything. I'm not leaving. Gotcha. But. Okay. You guys, are you guys on parole probation? No, not no, no. most wanted. No, I'm you guys have an identifications on you. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why she called. But she just out of nowhere came behind me, and I was at the house buying the car, and she's like, "People are extra good vigilant." Yeah, I figured. We call that every day. We just want to make sure that there's no suspicious activity going on. So, yeah, bro. appreciate you guys' cooperation. I'll be right back. Yeah. All right. Appreciate it. Okay. Make sure you get that license plate taken care of for you. Yeah. Okay. All right. Also, just out of curiosity, what did she call me in for? Suspicious vehicle. Vehicle not, not not seen in the area. You guys were parked in a couple different driveways, I guess, or rolling around or something like that. Wow. Okay. So I don't. I don't. I've never been on this side. I just literally went up a curb, yeah. snapped my license plate. I was like, you know, screwed. I'm gonna buy the car and then. Yeah. As far as a suspicious vehicle, I can't pull you over for if you're looking suspicious. Uh, the reason I pulled you over is your front license plate. For sure. That just gave me a reason to contact. Make sure you guys weren't doing anything up here that you shouldn't have been. Okay. Yeah. Right on. Okay, guys. Right, safe. Well, take it easy. All right, guys, we are officially back from getting the car and everything. Um, as you guys can probably tell from the clips, actually, I don't know if I put the clips in or not. I'm going to throw them in right now or if I already did in the video. We got pulled over for some ridiculous stuff. We got pulled over for having a suspicious vehicle in the area. Now, this girl <laughs> out of nowhere with cowboy shoes and a cowboy hat in her giant truck, I'm not naming where she's from, comes up behind me, takes pictures of my car, and calls the police for suspicious behavior, and I get pulled over for having no plates because that's the only reason, like, he could have gave to pull me over. And, you know, he was talking, he was checking my my uh, my ID, my, you know, the driver license and everything. Anyways, that calls for good footage, so I hope you guys enjoyed that part. All right, guys, so if you enjoyed this video, smash the like button. There's a lot of crazy videos coming up. I'm going to be working on this car for the meantime, just until April 4th to get my brother's car. Don't worry, guys, I'm going to be doing all kinds of crazy shit to my brother's car, but this also brings more content 
I've been kind of lacking on the content end, and that's because my car is pretty much done. Everything else that I really need to do on it is getting expensive. You know, we're talking like motor swaps, we're talking transmission swaps, we're talking, you know, turbos, bags. Those stuff are getting very, very, very expensive, and I don't want to spend that kind of money on my car, at least not now. Um, so I might as well just start some other projects going, and um, down the road, we'll do those insane mods. But um, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed the video and you like where the channel is going, smash the like button. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Shawty hit my line and she's tryna get up on me I tell her like Habibti, that's too hot on Wallahi Where they are, I was raised with Somali Everyone got a friend named Abi I'm from OT